Hi, I'm Kim. And I'm Anita. And it's been a while since we did a video, um, a, a conversation mm -hmm. with Anita and Kim. So uh, we figured we'd give you guys an update of what's been going on in our lives so that you um, so that you'll know that what we're doing. That's our dog down there, Mason. He wants to, I guess he wants to be in a video. You guys met him one time before, but say hello, Mason, since you want to be up here. Anyway, you want to start on what you've been working on? What I've done is I've written a book. It's a sci-fi book for teens and adults. It's called Anoids. It's about anoids that come to, which are half human and half animal. And they come to Earth, and they want to take over and control Earth. And Alex, the hero, uh, is here to prevent them. And there's a new Earth where the voice, is, which is an entity, is trying to set up a new Earth in case Alex isn't able to contain the anoids. Uh, you go to my website, anoids.com, so you can read about it. I put in a uh, information on there about Greek mythology. Also, I have a contest for a $500 value statue of reptile that you can also win. And it will be coming out as when the book is released. I'm editing it now, so hopefully it won't be too much longer. And so again, an ananoids.com, come check out the website. Okay. okay. Um, as you guys once um, knew, we used to have a shop called uh, UniqueThingsOnline.com. Well, we didn't do too well with that, so I branched out into the toy market, actually a collectible toy market. And I want to show you some of the items that I got on my website that's up for sale. And as to uh, why I went into the toy market, for one, I, I was collecting Funkos way back in 2016. So that's where I originally got the idea for the toy market because I wanted to buy uh, the Funkos at wholesale price so that I could get them at a cheaper discount. And like I said before, uh, with that happening, that made me start wanting to sell some of the Funkos that I got because I had too many of them. So I'm just gonna uh, move out the way so that, that you can see the statues behind me. Um, again, this is a collectible uh, toy store. So it's not really for, if you're looking for toys like for your grandkids or something that's under the age of 14, this, this is not the website for you, but it's a collectible market that as time goes on, these things will go up in value. Yes. All right. So without further ado, I'm going to move out the way. Anita, move okay. out the way. so that And, and just because y'all saw Mason um, yawn, it doesn't mean he's bored with what we're saying. <laughs> Watch out. Gigi's behind you, too. Okay. And uh, so the first thing... Babe, move. Jiggy behind. All right, the first statue is uh, Zangief from Street Fighter uh, number five. Uh, that was um, made in 2016. It's based off the 3D model. Uh, it's by Pop Culture Shock. Uh, for those who don't know Pop Culture Shock, it might go by the name of PCS. So. And this is an exclusive limited edition. Only 125 was made. And this is number 118. And it stands about, oh, before I go into that, it has an alternate head that comes with it. So this one is his attack mode, but then there's got the alternate skull has him with yelling. So I'm sorry I didn't bring that out. But, um, he stands about 27 inches tall, and as you can see, his uh, hands come out. He comes, his hands and his head comes out, and he comes off the uh, uh, stand as well. So, I'm sorry, 130. No, I was right. 125 was made. He's made of uh, polystone. 
And he also comes with a signed print by the artist Edwin Hen. Hugh, I'm not saying his name right, but it comes with a signed print. Also, he comes with a certificate of authenticity so that you get that and a pair of gloves that comes with it. And he's retailing for uh, $575, $575.99. That includes shipping. So if you want to look at, uh, find him, you can find him on my website at kimstoycloset.com. The next one I have is uh, from the movie Pacific Rising. That was done in 2018. Hold on a little closer so I can get a good look at it. Okay. And it was done in 2018. And this was done by Diamond Select. Uh, this is not a limited edition or anything. It's just the, the Diamond Select movie line that they did so that you can see. So uh, this is Gypsy Avenger from the movie. I wish they had put a LED little light in here but i think with mine that's what i'm gonna do is put a little led light in there so that it lights up so that i just think it would be cool if it had it so uh this one stands about 10 inches tall it's a damarama and it, again it's based off the um off the movie pacific uprising and it also comes in a window display box so you don't have to take it out the box. You could just display it in the box because you can see it. But however, I like to take it out so that it looks good. I mean, not that it doesn't look good in the box, but this one retails for my website for $45.99 plus shipping. The next um, statue I have is uh, the Drowned. Now, I didn't know too much about the Drown until after I got the statue, but I thought it was a cool statue. And the Drown is based off the Aquatic Batman Dark uh, Multiverse series. And what I found out about it is that uh, the Dark, the dark uh, thing was back in um, 2017 was the first issue with her called the uh, Dark Days Casting. And it goes into her storyline. And apparently she's related to Bruce Wayne, but I don't know how she's related to Bruce Wayne. So her real name is Bryce Wayne. And she basically used to be a good good person until her boyfriend was killed. Uh, Sylvester Kyle was killed by some meta humans. And then for some reason she snapped and decided that she was gonna kill all meta humans. And then, and she also wound up killing, killing Aqua Woman and taking her trident. So this is the trident of Aqua Woman. But um, anyway, she stands about 10 inches tall. And she, again, she's not a um, limited edition, but it is a hand sculpted and it's made of PVC and the uh, paint is highly detailed on here. And she goes by the name Drown after she joined the, the Batman uh, Who Laughs uh, character. And I guess they're trying to fight the metahumans on the, uh, on the level above them because they are from the uh, negative Earth negative 11 series that's where she came from she was um on the earth negative 11 series so she's available for 42 dollars and um 99 cents and it, um you have to pay shipping with this but it's a beautiful statue again with something like this i wish they would have put uh led lights in here to make it light up it would have been really cool but that's something that I'm going to add to myself and maybe something that you could add for yourself. She would go good with either your Batman collection or your Aquaman co collection because she fought both in both series. So again, kimstoycloset.com, you can find her. I'll give you a better look at the statue. I think it's really cool. I really do. Yes, it is. So, Very nice. Very detailed. 
Yeah. So the next statue I have is Ryu from Street Fighter. And this is a massive uh, statue. It's very huge. It stands about 30 inches tall. Yeah, it's about 30 inches tall. And it's made out of um, hand um, handcrafted polystone. He uh, detaches from the base of him. I don't want to lift him because he's very heavy, but he detaches from the base and his head detaches. So there's only really three pieces to this. It's the body, the, the base, and the head. And this is a limited edition as well. And it was only 350 made of these. Yeah, 350 made of these. And this piece is number 139. But the cool thing is, as I was talking about light ups, his eyes light up. I don't know if you can see that close by. Let me bring the camera so that you can see that his eyes light up. So I think that is a very cool statue. And see the details on his arm and everything? But I'm not here to do reviews. I'm just here to show you what's available on our website. I'm going to turn off his eyes so that you can see. That's what he looks like without his eyes. And that's his eyes. So, yeah. And he also comes with a, a certificate of authenticity and a pair of gloves for handling him. There's also his clothing is tailored, is fabric. That's not like painted on or sculpted on like most statues. This is actually fabric that's on. And same thing with his uh, headband. So those of you who are, who are familiar with the Street Fighter series, you know this is the longest running character that they've had and also the most popular character that they have. So he's retailing on my website for um, $7.75. He usually, uh, he retails around $8.99 so that's a $124 discount that you're getting again is that with free shipping yeah that's with free shipping included so $775.99 free shipping and the same thing with um Zan gift he's uh also let me turn you back around to him $575.99 free shipping as well and he's 27 inches tall and he comes with an alternate head and a certificate plus a, a print signed by the artist as well. So that's all the statues that, that, well, that's not all that I have on my website, but I just wanted to show you a few of the statues that I, I carry on my website so that, come back in here, so that you guys would know what we got going on. So thank you. Cool. And I thank you. And Anoids is A N I N O I D S dot com. Come check out my website, please. And my website is Kim's Toy Closet dot com. All one word. Thank you. Bye bye.